everyone and welcome my fellow YouTubers, subscribers, followers, fans <laughs> and ta other tarot readers from all around the world who's clicked this video from a 10th to 23rd October reading, 2021 reading for Leo. So the spread is super duper, super simple. Situation, challenge, outcome and advice. And how did this get here? And it's a surprise at the end so stick around and find out. I'm using Witch's Style by Ellen Duggan. So let's do this. Leo, Leo, Leo. Did you know your tarot card is strength, major? Because it's a card of power, a card of taking the effort. And somehow there's always something really powerful there. Like a lion or something like that. Because sometimes they're modulated. It, but it's very true there's a lion always there. And you're a Leo, so that makes complete sense. And why are some cards twisted? One second, dudes. I'll do that. So, let's do this. Situation, challenge, outcome, and advice. So, let's see. Your situation is... Hmm. Ten of Swords. Something has ended. <laughs> because whenever Ten of Swords comes, don't think of it as it being sad. It just means that the cycle has ended. You have to move on now. Because after ten, you go all the way back to one. So. So. <laughs> Ten of Swords, and there's an owl watching, so that means there's a witness for you. So that means that you're watching yourself, you're seeing it happen. So now the challenge for moving on is, you felt a very much relationship with this challenge, because there was something you really liked about this area. Because, it look, because lovers is a card of Gemini, and also a card of, well, dual sync. That means you are in sync with yourself. Your challenge is to sync with yourself because because it looks like you have to you have to your yin and your yang have to come together so that you can move on. So, so please do that because because you're watching all of this happen. This is you. This is your entire self. And this is your yin and yang energy. You have to make them come together. So now, your outcome will be justice. A card of Libra, which is a card of seeing what is right. Because, because justice does not take bribes or anything. It is pure, concentrated law. Because you cannot tweak justice. <laughs> Because she is holding a balance scale, which shows that she gives even respect to everybody, a millionaire and a poor person. And the sword means a sword of truth, a sword. And Libra is an air sign and I'm a Libra. So yeah, the sword of truth and there are flowers around her, which makes her in a very glorified area. And she's wearing a crown, which makes her, which makes her a very, which makes you, you very important. So your, so your outcome will be justice will prevail. I can't say it's good or it's bad, but I can say justice will prevail. And now your advice is eight of cups. Wow, the ten of swords chapter is over. Now walk away from it. Because Eight of Cups is a card of walking away from something that no longer serves you. You've dr Like, if you have an empty bottle, you'll either refill it or look for a new bottle. When you're all out of bottles, you refill them all again. It's kind of like a cycle, like from 10 to 1 and 1 to 10. Wow. So it looks like you're, you're looking, you're seeing how wide the world is. Looks like your advice is to walk away from it. Walk away from things that are not needed. Don't walk away from things that are needed. Identify the difference. Now for a surprise. Dun, 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 dun. It is a Moonology message. Gonna shuffle it four times. The card 
word is take time to breathe out this amazing <coughs> moon. It looks like the fog is covering it. So breathe out. Calm yourself. Pace yourself. Okay? <coughs> because something has ended, you have to put, and you have to try your best to put yourself in sync with yourself so that you can end it on a high note. <coughs> I'll let justice prevail. Always look to the moon and while you're looking to the moon, you'll walk away from things no longer needed. So that's all for your reading, Leo. <coughs> Have a great October. Viva Vienna. Peace, peace, peace.